knocked out Coalition 14, guys. We're uh, one step closer to getting our uh, Chimera tank and wrapping up Operation Chimera. So this one we just barely squeezed out at the end of this uh, this match. It was a uh, nail-biter, but we got it done. Um, for this, we have to do uh, seven kills. It really is that simple, and uh, you need to survive if you want to do the uh, secondary to complete with honors, which I, I did in this instance. Um, this one is, uh, uh, it can be uh, difficult if you are not getting uh, top tier. Uh, if you're getting uh, equal tier, it can be done, but top tier just makes it uh, uh, that much easier. Uh, luckily, uh, I just purchased the, uh, the P-43 Tier 7 Italian tank. In fact, it, my crew isn't even 100% uh, from retraining them uh, from the previous tank. Uh, that's how new this tank is. I probably only have five or six matches in it. Um, I spent some free XP to get the upgraded gun in it, uh, but I don't have the upgraded uh, engine, so I'm moving a little slow here. But the, the beauty of this match is I got top tier, um, and that really, really helps in, in getting this done. Now, uh, the first thing I did when I came into this match is I looked at the enemy composition, and I saw that I think they only had one heavy tank, and so I pushed over here immediately. Because I knew that I could bully almost any tank that was over here. I think the only uh, tank that was even remotely going to stand up to me was the uh, uh, Panther. And I felt confident that the Panther was not going to come over here. I thought the Panther would go down the, uh, um, the east side of the map towards the south. Uh, he actually stayed uh, uh, this side a little bit. Or maybe he came back when he saw what was happening on this side of the map. Um, but... The point is, because there was only one heavy tank, I felt like it, I could just come over to this side. There would only be a couple tanks. I could get them done early. And here I am, uh, just three minutes into the match, or two minutes into the match. I have two kills, um, and I'm in the rear of, uh, of their lines right now, which is a fantastic uh, position to be in. And so now I just want to uh, uh, move into essentially sniper mode, get some of these tanks uh, that are in front of me out. Um, let my team sort of do some damage in the, the confusion of this and see if I can't just sneak out a, a couple kills. There's another kill there. Uh, so we're at three of, of seven kills, and now we just need to start moving in and being aggressive. Um, uh, now, I'm taking a lot of shots here, um, but because I'm top tier, in fact, there's that, uh, that panther that I was worried about. Because I'm top tier, I am uh, confident that I have the, the HP and maybe even a little bit of the armor to get this done. Um, so I'm being a, a little bit uh, uh, reckless here, but uh, I felt like I needed to to get this uh, uh, these kills racked up. Now, these are the kind of, of mistakes that, uh, that will cost you. Um, I actually ran this uh, a bunch of times in the bat cap, the tier 10 uh, medium tank. Um, those two tanks should just be dead in front of me. And some of it has to do with the fact that I don't have 100% crew on this tank. Uh, but the reality is I should have killed both of those tanks. So there's really no excuse. So this is actually easier than, than it looks uh, if you're top tier. Um, you just got to make shots like that to get this, this mission done. So um, if you can, you know, make sure that you have 100% crew. Um, uh, do whatever you run food if you uh, if you have to you feel you have to do whatever you need to do to make sure that you're you're able to hit the shots that you need uh, because I missed out on on two tanks right there that I should have killed and would have made this really easy to get done now um, you could see that my my poor VK friend is back there dealing with the panther I want nothing to do with that panther guys um, I, I need the three kills uh, I feel bad for leaving him back there but this is all about the the mission at this point. And there's only four tanks left, so I have to kill three of those four tanks to get this mission done. So I want to be as far away from that panther as possible because he will kill me in his, his current state. Um, we're going to get a, a fifth kill right here. Um, and then I can start to think about what to do about that panther because the STRV is, is way down south. There's a couple guys that are moving north to, uh, to deal with that panther. And, of course, already starts to, to rain down on me. Um, with the Panther in that position that he's in, I'm just waiting for one more shot on him. There it is. I'm going to sneak my, my kill in. And now I'm going to go deal with this already before that STRV uh, starts to uh, uh, to come down. Or at least I thought I was because now I'm just uh, uh, probably at two shot for the, uh, the STRV. 
So I gotta get up this hill as quick as I can and avoid getting shot. There's one shot already. I'm thinking I'm not gonna get this done. But I sneak around this corner and I thought maybe I could sneak a shot into this, uh, this party right here. Um, but the, uh, the autoloader on that guy was just too quick. There was no way I was gonna get that done. But the good news is the STRV is uh, is full health, so it's going to take a little bit to uh, um, to kill him. I load gold. I'm in a good position. He, I'm not spotted. I'm just going to wait for my team to do the damage, and I'm going to sneak that last kill in. So um, this is Coalition uh, 14 with honors because we did survive. Uh, I know last shot of the uh, the match completed that, so we we got that done by the skin of our teeth. But um, uh, that's how this this mission goes. Like I said, I tried a bunch of times at tier 10 with the bat chat, got some top guns out of it, um, just uh, missed it a couple of times. Um, but I think this is easier to do at lower tier. Um, the, the bat chat at tier 10 is fantastic because you have so much potential in your clip, particularly if you go after things like arty late game where you might be able to even one shot some of the arty that you come across, or you can use a single clip to kill two arty at the same time. Um, but I think it's still easier at low tier. And if you look at the low tier tanks in the coalition, maybe the Leo in the, uh, the Swedish line or this uh, uh, P43 at the tier seven Italian is the, the right tanks to do this in. Um, if you are top tier, you have to be aggressive. You have to figure out where on that map you're gonna be able to single a couple people out early on and you just need to move on them, kill them, and then start to, uh, to figure out where your next kills are going to be. Um, the last thing that I would say is because this is one of the harder missions uh, within uh, uh, Operation Chimera, if you have to platoon to get this done, do it. Just bring a couple of friends, have them be meat shields for you, um, make sure that they know what their alpha is and what their job is, which is to, to do damage and not, not do kills. Uh, you can actually get this done pretty easily if you take that approach as well. So if you need to uh, find a couple of friends, uh, I would recommend if you're going to do that approach to run uh, heavy tanks so that uh, so that they can uh, uh, take damage and, and be out in front. Um, but it is a way to, to get this done if you're having trouble doing it uh, solo. So we have two more missions, guys. We have Coalition 15 and Alliance uh, 15 to, uh, to complete Operation Chimera. So hopefully I'll knock those out soon and I'll see you guys in the next one.